welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel Ray and today I'm going to do a sneak peek video from Diamond Art Club. Thank you so much DAC for sending me this canvas to share with everyone. Now this one, I love this artist. I have not seen anything lately from this artist. This is a round drill kit from my Catalina. <gasps> It's Iris. Oh, y'all, that that does not that does not actually show much. So let's just get into it because there's a bigger picture inside. How are you, TGIF? I hope that you all had a wonderful week. And if you work on the weekends, I I apologize. I'm sorry for all of my excitement. However, this means that tomorrow. Diamond Art Club is going to be releasing this kit and others on their website, diamondartclub.com. And this releases for Diamond and Ruby Club members at 9 a.m. Pacific time and 9.30 a.m. for general release. I'm excited. Now, I'm going to show you what's inside this kit and then we're going to look at it really in depth and hopefully it won't take too long. But this is a sticker. You can put this on the outside of the kit. Uh, you could put it in a journal. You could do whatever you like with it. This is the toolkit. It's kind of self-explanatory, but I'll show you what's inside. Uh, this has everything that you need to really start diamond painting. But if you get like me and you really, really like diamond painting, you might want some accessories to go with that. Go and check out my <gasps> ooh new color pen. Um, ooh, and matching. Okay. All right. Diamond Art Club. I see you. Um, go check out my diamond painting accessories playlist if you would like to see other fun, you know, bougie <laughs> accessories for diamond painting. But this is the pen. Comes with a pen grip. Look at that. It's like a, it's like a burgundy color. It's a grape wine color. This toolkit also comes with these multi-placer tips. I love the four-placer. It's my favorite. But there's also a seven-placer if you want to, you know, put down loads at a time. There is a cover minder. Look at this cute little cover minder. How adorable is that? We've also got some washi tape. Very cute. Very pretty. That you can put on the edges. In here we have some heart-shaped wax. Oh, and a little piece of... Anyway, two plates of heart-shaped shaped wax in there for you to use in your pen. We've got a drill tray. This one has a stopper on it. Uh, these are nice. These are good for if you're changing a lot of colors. If you need, if you're finding that you're refilling your tray a lot and you don't like it, try getting a bigger tray. It'll change your life, especially if you'd like to do color blocking like me. And then we've got a bag of baggies that's kind of self-explanatory. When you open up the drills, you'll see uh, you might want to have somewhere to put those drills if you're not using the whole bag at a time, which honestly, I don't really ever use a bag at a time unless it's like a huge section of one color that you're just kind of knocking out of the park. So that's the toolkit. Let's get to the inside here. Diamond Art Club, do what makes you sparkle. And if you've never purchased from Diamond Art Club before, I have a coupon down below if you'd like to use it. It is an affiliate code. Um, so I would receive a small commission for those of you who have not purchased before. If you have purchased before, there are actually loads of coupons available. Um, there's one on the bottom. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There's diamonds falling out. Um, there's ones on the canvases. There's one in the... There's a... Whatchamacallit? Hang on a minute. Hold on a sec. Okay, sorry. I'm going to use this little tray. I got this from Panda's Crafty Corner or... Um, I'll have her link to um, just to kind of put those drills in because otherwise they're probably going to spill. Um, but look, look, look at this. <gasps> she is so beautiful. Long purple hair, butterfly wings. Look at that dress on the swing. Micah Jelena is, has beautiful, beautiful ladies. Um, if you like this style, definitely check her out, the profile out on Diamond Art Club's website. I'll link that too. There's 39 colors in this kit. Oh my goodness, what is that? We have specialty diamonds, y'all. So here we got the symbol list. 
quite easy to read these symbols, nothing too complicated. There are three AB diamonds in this and there's two specialty ones. Those must be crystals? I don't know. I don't know. I haven't seen anything like that yet. So let's get into this. Iris, 51 by 107. <laughs> She's big. Round drill though. Round drill. It'll be fine. We'll get there. All right. And we also have that booklet I was talking about, the instructions. We've got um, a discount code in there too. They do regular discounts and stuff on the website as well. So it's worth signing up for their newsletter or going, oh no, a bag broke, or going um, to their VIP Facebook group once you've made an order. Let's see if I can find it. Can you see all the diamonds down here? That very rarely happens, but I'm going to open this up and find it and clean it up so that you don't have to watch me struggle. I found it. I found the whole teeny tiny itty bitty hole right there. I'm just going to fill that, put some tape on that, and then I'll put the extras in a little zip up bag. If someone here eventually one day takes this away from my house, whether it be from D stash or uh, whatnot, and you find a piece of Luna fur in here. Uh, if you decide that you're going to clone my dog, just um, make sure that you contact me first, okay? Okay, okay, okay. All right, let's go ahead and look at this canvas. Oh my goodness, it's so long. So, this is the Diamond Art Club canvas. I absolutely adore it. It is one of my favorite canvases to work on. Um, the symbols are super duper clear. Can you see this? It is poured glue and the glue is squishy, so it's nice to work with, in my opinion. <laughs> but also, it's super pliable, you can take it anywhere. Um, just be warned that if you have pets, that fuzzy back is probably going to catch some dog hair. So here we go. <gasps> Ooh, this is going to be interesting. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. She almost looks like a cross stitch. <laughs> so diamond painting is like cross stitching or paint by numbers. And basically you do this pixel by pixel, right? Uh, you can single place or you can multi-place. I would highly recommend multi-place in the background, but only if you're confident in that. Um, it is nice and relaxing to do. And oh my goodness, she looks so good. Like I said, uh, a few a few unboxings ago, Diamond Art Club changed their round drill canvas to look more like what the finished product is going to look like with the colors and everything. She looks so good. I really, really like this canvas. I like her face. I like her dress. I like the way that it that it's coming together. Those vines with the roses. This is so pretty. This is like, this is like me growing up in the 90s. This is what I would want on my wall. <laughs> my inner child is so happy right now. So as you can see on here, we have the information, the picture, the copyright information. You have all the, you know, the legend on both ends of this kit. I'd highly, highly recommend using those stickers that came with it though on your container system because once you get past here you're gonna have no guide to look at so either by just putting this to the side and helping you or to actually label your containers I think that this is is a brilliant way to diamond paint um, let's look even closer at her face so you can have a nice good look at those symbols So pretty oh my goodness now let's quickly just look at the diamonds there's a lot of black in this so 310 fans out there you see me I see you <laughs> let's see how many bags this has one two three four five six seven eight nine there's a broken bag ten bags of 310 that's not too bad, actually. 10 bags? That's nothing. All right, then we have 
803, right here, 939, which is a dark blue, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 of those, 311, 823, we have two bags, and 562, beautiful green. We also have that little bit of, a, of 310 that fell out. Here's our, oh my gosh, our crystals. Those are going to look so pretty. So we have 3843 and 5200. This is a silver, not a white. And we have a blue. So pretty. We'll see where those go in just a moment. 3837, 797, 704. 959, 333, 3842, 996, 807, 122, there's an AB, AB stands for Aurora Borealis, and look at that iridescent sparkle, it's so pretty, so that must be in the vines around her, 3746, and then we have 3765, 3805, 3607. Here's another AB, 132. Oh, an orange. This one kind of has that tropical, like a orange passion fruit with pink. 554, 820, 601, 208, 993, 318, 762. 561. Another AB, 113. This one's pink. Very bright pink. Almost like Pink Panther pink. 33, 33, 30, 40. I can get it out. 351, 917, 3832, 600, 444, and 3766. Those are all of our colors. So let's see where those ABs and the and the crystals go. First AB is number one and that's the pink panther pink and that is up in the crown and also in these pink roses going down the side. Number two is the green and let's see where are you? Where are you green number two? I'm looking for it. Oh it is not in there at all like I thought it was. It is not in the vines. Rather, it is actually on the outline of her dress. So we have it here. We have it, some of them here in the creases of her sash. We have some right here uh, where the dress, there's like, I don't remember what you call this, where it splits off, but it's see-through. There's a name for that in fashion. I am not a fashionista. Then we have some here, some here. It's basically just giving color to those areas around the edges of this iridescent piece of her dress. Iridescent? Transparent <laughs> is the word. And number three is orange. Orange AB, which I see some up in here. There. And on a few of these flowers coming down the side. I think you can see it just there in those flowers. Just a little bit. Just a tiny touch of it. And why does that look like a sad face? <laughs> From here in the camera, it looks like a sad face. It ca caught me off guard. But when you're actually looking at the piece, that does not look like a sad face. <laughs> then we have the crystals. Okay, so this is the exciting part. We have the blue crystal, which is like an O symbol. Aha! It's in the background. So there's these little blue dots. You can see the white dots really clearly. And guess what? The white dots are the clear crystals and the blue dots are the blue crystals. So it's all in the background there. Coming down the side here as well, we've got white crystal and here and then there's some blue crystal in here. We have white crystals all down the front of this dress just scattered still scattered here as well so there's only blue crystals to about here 
So up here, 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 and there. Very pretty. This is a beautiful painting. I would love to know what you think down below. I know this video has gone lo long enough, but what do you think? I love it. I think it'll be super fun to diamond paint and the effect is going to look so good. It's going to be super sparkly and it has crystals. Yes, please. So if you're interested and you'd like to get this, it will be available on Saturday, the 24th of September. And like I said, 9 a.m. Pacific for Ruby and Diamond Club members and 9.30 a.m. Pacific for everyone else. Uh, hopefully you get one if you want one. Thank you so much for watching my video, this little reveal. I hope that it, you found it helpful. And if you did, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos here in the future. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everyone. Bye.